Hey guys, everything IP is already touched. Back again here with another video. Let's just start out. Uh, first, I want you guys to get all the sources. Um, just, it's a good thing to have. It's really useful and you can get a lot of stuff from it. Let city load. I'm just going to come back when the thing is loaded up, guys. Alright, guys, so this is, um,. I think the easiest way to get this, um, go to that more package sources. I know that this is kind of old, but it this seems to be easier for me. I'll go down and find Pwn Center, right there, and install it and stuff. Um, so once you have that installed, go to sections, go to repositories, and all sources will be there. I've just like in already installed it, so that's only pretty much all that you have to do in Cydia until you have to like install the apps. Um, so my top ten apps. Um, Winterboard is really cool because it allows you to customize your Springboard. Um, for not only my Wi-Fi but my um computer too. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, it just lets you toggle stuff. Um, next one is probably going to be Installus. Installus is great. Um, you can get any, pretty much any app in the App Store for free. Um, without an Apple account. So this is kind of cool. Uh, yeah, you just pretty much search. And then once you get it, you just get in your downloads and you install it from there. So that's really cool. Uh, free apps is always nice. Um, mobile Finder is pretty cool. Uh, I don't know why it just crashed. Okay, uh, there's obviously some problems with that. <laughs> have to check that out. Yeah, but that's Finder. Um, pretty cool. It's kind of just, it's exactly what it is. If you've had a Mac or whatever, it's just Finder, but on your iPod. Um, next app, MXTube. Uh, this is really cool. Um, basically, you can go on YouTube, or you can download YouTube videos. It's pretty cool. Uh, I'll just search, I don't know, um, iPod. Let it load. And you can download and high quality. And it'll download and then you can watch it flawless quality. Whatever. Um, so then that's um, MXTube. You don't need Wi Fi only if you're gonna download the videos, but you know, I went if you're gonna go like camping or something. You want to watch YouTube, that's a good thing to have. Um, next app, Font Swap. This is really cool, I think. Uh, you can change the fonts that they have. They give you like, like 10 or 11 fonts to begin with. I'm using Neo Sans Intel just because I kind of like the look of it. But uh, yeah, then you'll have to respring and. I don't know if you guys can see, but my font is a little different than your guys'. Uh, next app is going to be Backgrounder. Now, it just has the icon there, but what Backgrounder allows you to do is it allows you to like listen to... Um, just for example, um, say you have an app that's playing music or whatever, and you exit out of it and it stops playing the music. We'll say you just wanted to check your emails while you were listening to that song, but so you could just like press and hold home button, and it would enable the backgrounder thing, so you could listen to that elsewhere. It's really cool. Um, you can just run apps in the background. Uh, next one is gonna be Make It Mine. Um, just type in everything.
and you can see it's my banner. Um, you can see that I replaced iPod with IP0D, and to get nothing, you just do that. Um, next up is going to be probably categories. This is really cool. Um, you can add a category. Basically, if you have like a bunch of apps on your spring, well, it has to respring. One sec, guys. Sorry. Okay, we're back here. Um, <laughs> one sec here. Let me pause this, guys. All right, guys. Sorry about that. But yeah, categories. You can um, put apps into categories and just um, access them if you have like a bunch of apps. Um, and then screen splitter. What I'm recording with. Uh, it's pretty easy. Um, if you guys have any questions, uh, PM me if you want to do this. Um, it's pretty easy. You just download the app, and you have to do a couple things. But then it's done, and it's like flawless quality, so I think it's pretty worth it. Um, next app is probably going to be Stacks. Stacks is really cool. Uh, I have all my favorite apps here. Installers, Mail, Cydia, Wonderboard, and Wasprefs. And it's all just in one thing where I can access it anywhere on the springboard. And, um, but yeah, that's, that's a cool app. It's pretty convenient. Um, I think next would probably be Boss Prefs. Boss Prefs, you can, um, use, toggle Wi-Fi, toggle SSH, um, you can even edit what's going on. Like, see, I only have screen splitter. But that's just to, like, say, you can adjust brightness to really bright, to not bright, and then you can turn stuff off. Wait, sorry guys. You can respring, you can have just a little dock of icons there. Uh, you can refresh, and you can get this little, um, one sec here. You can get that numeric battery thing. Which is kind of cool. Uh, here we go again with that. So I'll be right back, guys. All right, guys. Sorry about that. So yeah, you can get the new Merrick battery thing. Um, so those are my favorite apps. Jailbroken. Um, that's probably what I would download. Like those are my apps that I pretty much have to have. Um, it's a total of like. 12 apps, so I'm just going to say top 10 in the title. Um, I would suggest all of these. Um, there's a bunch more out there um, that I like, but I just, like I said, I had to uh, restore my iPod last night. I am working on getting the 3.1 firmware, um, or 3.0.1 or whatever it is. I'm working on trying to get a job. I'm just tweaking it myself, um, using red snow and stuff, and just the 3.1 firmware. Actually, have my oops, not Facebook. <laughs> my iPod 1G is running 3.1, which is pretty cool. Uh, really, no differences for the iPod Touch, but you know, for those people that like to be up to date. So, if I find out how to jailbreak that, um, I will definitely tell you guys. Uh, thanks for watching this video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. I've been getting quite a few subscribers lately, so thanks guys for that. That's really helping me out. I'm getting probably like a subscriber a day now. Um, got quite a few views.